Mugembe Kenneth and uh, I work with uh, a consultancy firm called Armstrong Consulting Engineers and I'm the director of the firm. Yeah, we are located in Golobi here in the heart of Kampala. I got to know about Timna through my wife. That was last year uh, towards the fall of the last lockdown. Uh, and around that time, we had tried a number of health programs, including diets and exercise regimes. And they were not working out because I remember around that time I decided to go for jogging for an entire month every single day and I did not lose even a single kilogram. So to me it was very frustrating. My wife intended to see another doctor around Golobi, but uh, she ended up stumbling on Tim Nath here and uh, certainly she was told very good things. Reluctantly I decided to come. And I knew that, okay, this is the same old story, and at the end of the day, they're interested in money. So, but when I came and met, and met uh, Dr. Etuket, he, he took measurements of me, these gadgets, and uh, what he told me really struck me. He told me that even when I'm, uh, I'm 41 years old, I was living in a body of a 67 year old man. So to me, that was a eureka moment. I spoke to myself and someone all the energy I had within me and said, Kenneth, you must turn the wheels. So we really had to make a decision to change the way we were living. And to me, I have a number of areas that I look at as success and health is one of them. But this time around, I considered health as my topmost priority. Well, at that time I came and met doctor and uh, they gave us a menu that we are meant to follow. Here, this is the ketogenic diet and uh, certainly it's not a, a diet for the faint-hearted. But I can assure you when you start on it, you realize that actually you can, you can survive. Uh, along the same journey, I'd also begun on the exercises. His exercises, he does exercise in such a way that you really want to go back the following day. Every other day, actually, it's him who tells you, no, you need to rest. Because rest is as equally important as uh, the exercise themselves. So I was doing both, dieting and exercises. Around that time, I'd just taken my usual uh, body checks and uh, I've been doing this for the last eight years. I was used to having my cholesterol being high. I was used to having my, the good cholesterol would always be slightly moderate, but the bad one was always high. So you get to a point where you accept this because you've done it all and it's not changing. I was used to uh, having challenges with uh, my uric acid, which was always very high, I should say. And when I got on the ketogenic diet, uh, because you are mostly on, on protein, it's a protein diet, so eat a little more milk, meat and less of carbs, certainly my cholesterol first went up and I, I came to the doctor and had a discussion and he allayed my fears and you know because I just began with the program but I trusted him and after one month and a half I came back and reduced by a whooping seven kilograms one month and a half it had never happened in the history of my exercise regime and so to me that was the first indication that I was in the right place when I went back he told me no continue on this program and I can assure you all your body checkups will be in the normal way. So I continued and I couldn't believe the results I got. I actually had to change the lab and decided to go to one of the best labs and I could not believe what I could see because my cholesterol, my bad cholesterol had completely gone down and the good cholesterol shot up. I even showed the results to my wife. But you know, because it was the best lab, I said, no, you can't doubt this. And this has been consistent over some time. And uh, truth be told, my entire wardrobe I've had to change. Every cloth I have there can no longer fit me. And people who see me tell me that I look younger and happier. But I think one of the biggest achievements that I've brought in out of this program is the fact that my mental capacity has grown. I've gone through a number of challenges. Challenges before that could devastate me. But I've seen myself gliding over them, and simply because I do these exercises, I, I even feel uh, my character and personality has changed. My EQ, my, my emotional intelligence has also changed. So I would really encourage everyone out 
necessary to try out the exercise regime that he normally has. It's a very unique one, you will not find it anywhere else. I've forgotten about the job, honestly speaking, because he, I don't have the time to go into that, but he tells you that jogging is not a very good exercise. And uh, I can assure you, I have embraced this. I've seen my life change. Something else I need to talk about is the fact that I did the ketogenic diet for one, for one month and a half, and I had to transition back to the carb diet. The carb diet is like the normal diet. However, here, he never took me back to the original lifestyle I had of eating everything, but he ended up taking me to a point where I would eat certain foods that included carbohydrates, but at the end of the day, it, I maintained my weight. I, I, I'm no longer destructive in the way I, I eat. Uh, there are foods that I do not eat, especially processed foods. There are combinations that I maintain, and then also there are times when I'm supposed to eat. It's all built around your setting and you come and really discuss with the man, he'll find a fit for you really. I should say that with the dieting actually it has made life very easy for me because you know I used to snack on a lot of junk, a lot of carbohydrates. I realized that I used to put in a lot of carbs and I did not know that I could do away with these carbs. But I realized that it's just a mental barrier that I had and uh, when I got when I decided to continue on this program, it became a practice and it turned into a habit. It has now become a lifestyle to me. Even when I travel for a month or a week, I still stick to it because you see real results. And uh, I'm happy, I should say. And I can show you, uh, has a lot of work to do out there. And I encourage them to uh, try as much as possible to spread this gospel because so many Ugandans are out there frustrated with their health. So many people don't want their bodies to feel like their foreign bodies. And uh, the exercises, I can assure you that when I came here, I could not even do three push-ups. I could collapse. I remember when uh, Jaja was on TV and he was able to do over, I don't know, 40 push-ups. I felt really uh, embarrassed that my age I could not even do three push-ups. But I'm happy to know that now I can do about 20 push-ups. I do resistance exercises, I lift weights. I mean, the weights, I, I could never lift weights. But within about one month and a half, two months, I could do all these things. And progressively, I've realized that the improvement is exponential. My physique has greatly improved in ways imaginable. So I'm very grateful. I'm really, really grateful. I've told a number of uh, my friends. Some of them are trying it out and they've seen the results. But at the end of the day, it also depends on your initial commitment. When you're committed with time, you realize that this time is your lifestyle and you'll never regret I can assure you, you can turn the wheels. One more. Good. Come up, come up, come up, come up. Not for the faint. <laughs>